it's Jerry here. My new series that we're doing, Doc and I, are, is taken from my play that I wrote back in, oh, it's been over 50 years ago when I was living up in southern Utah. And the name of the play is Happy Hello, Sad Goodbye. And it was, it, its setting was a mountain cabin up where we had a pasture on the mountain, a beautiful pasture called King's Pastures, which is quite famous in Southern Utah now. And uh, in this mountain pasture, uh, an old man, Joe Daniels, lives with his two granddaughters. And he raises, he's got a farm, and uh, he has some mules. And the two granddaughters, both of their parents, died and so he and his wife took over raising them which and then the wife died so this left poor old Joe here to take care of these two two little girls and now Joe they're about 16 and 14 and he's starting to get very sick and he's very worried and concerned about the fact that he well I'll tell you one thing Teenage girls can make anybody sick. As a matter of fact, teenagers are God striking back at you for having sex in the first place. You get it? They shouldn't have yes. had sex in the first place. <laughs> okay, Joe, well now that you're in the grandpa mode, uh, I'll come in in the first scene. Now, wait, how you like the shirt? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it looks great. Oh, it's goodness. like great. And then wonderful I uh, it today. I now, I'm going to play Laura Lee, who is Joe's sister-in-law. Want me to put my hat on? And there's a beautiful on. lake down. Want me to put my hat on? Oh, no. who cares? A lake's a lake. Oh, Space, no, it's the know? silver what mirror. What makes a beautiful lake? Well, Laura Lee's drowned there 28 years ago, so it's no, pretty minute. significant this to her. This sounds familiar to me. Yes, she drowned there. It sounds like an old song or something like that. That's right. She drowned there, oh, and uh, so she's been dead a long time, but uh, she's his sister-in-law, and his wife joined her, and but his wife had been there very long, so uh, Laura Lee, who's an old hand at these passings, uh, she comes back to, to see about Joe, who looks like he's just about to croak. No, I'm about to kill somebody, <laughs> as well as the monster, do, and uh, you ain't around two teenage girls. <laughs> Oh, that must be a mule. Well... No, that's not a mule, honey, you know. I love mules so much. I used to have a doorbell, you know. Then I figured out if I got one of those things down at the Ace Hardware store, you push the button and it goes, <laughs> Eeho! Eeho! <laughs> See? Well, how long have you been farming up here in this uh, beautiful mountain country? About four weeks. <laughs> Oh, Joe, you've had this farm for years and years and years. And now, where are the girls? The girls, yeah, the, I know, but the I two granddaughters. I've been farming for four weeks, you think? <laughs> those I'm two, too old you know, that, 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 those granddaughters of yours, they're, they're whiz, especially that older one. She can do anything on that farm. He's taught her, because he knows she can't last too long. So he's taught her to yeah, wait, but she to can't, mow. She can't to, pull a to, plow better than the mule. But yeah. I'll tell you what, she's real close. But, real oh, close. yeah. Oh, that girl's a whiz. Oh, no, that's not the word I was looking well, at. So he's he's uh, preparing those granddaughters for when he goes. And uh, so but he's going? quite worried. Well, he don't know where he's going. He don't believe in any heaven or anything like that. He's well, a, I'll tell you one thing right now. He's a skeptic. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, it couldn't be any worse than this. You two teenage girls. Oh my God, it's her. Uh, yeah, well, he's oh, pretty worried about the youngest one. Her. her name's Tilda, and she's a handful. Oh, and he's really worried Tilda. about how she's going to get take the news of his uh, illness. She's she's not going to like it one bit. So, because uh, she's had too many deaths in her family, and he's tried to live forever, but he's just not going to make it. So. This is what's on his mind. If he dies, what's going to happen to these little I don't have to know what the heck's on my mind because <laughs> I haven't any idea oh, where this and is then, going. And then to where add, it to add, to I add. I like my shirt though, isn't it? <laughs> huh? Oh, I love this one. 
This is a prop, by the way. I've never been yes. caught dead in this thing. In yes, and this is world. my spirit, my spirit sh dress. It's got butterflies on it. It's Laura Lee's spirit dress. Now, Laura Lee's not an angel, so we kind of got grayer, kind of a gray shade uh, to indicate her kind of mischievous spirit. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, are you trying to tell me you're one of them weirdos <laughs> from, uh, <laughs> ooh, you ain't in the heaven and you ain't in the hell? It's yes. a Catholic yes. thing going well, on. Well, yes, I'm trying to appear to must be in that place called... And he doesn't believe in the hereafter, so this is pretty tough. I don't believe but in the hereafter. But she's up to it. No, I don't believe I'm, in the She's here. up to it. She'll, she'll appear to this old tough codger, and he'll see her. And, oh, by the way... I don't like the way this is going. <laughs> there's another very uh, disturbing uh, complication. There's a stranger who has come around the mountain. You know, they come every now and then. A tour, you know, they come from faraway places, and he's been kind of snooping around the territory, and he's kind of spotted those girls. Now he's older; he must be at least 28. I mean, that's way too old for these 16, these girls. And are you kidding me? <laughs> and, are you uh, kidding me? So this this uh, this mysterious stranger is okay, about 68. Is going to get turned on by them teenage girls. That's right, so and, and Laura Lee, their aunt, is getting pretty concerned about this stranger, too. Just when Joe's getting ready to die, here's this stranger who is coming kind of a threat to these girls, and so she's really, you know, got, she's got a lot of worries on her mind. Now, so this is the plot of uh, Happy Hello, Sad Goodbye. So I hope you enjoy it, and the next, the next, uh, video will be scene one when Joe's up in the mountains feeling mighty sick and Laura Lee comes to call. <laughs>